Hi guys, this is Devanshu from Team Capture Kit, and we have built this Anytime automation using Screenshot API. So what this API does is it takes screenshot at scale. So suppose you want to take screenshot of thousand URLs, you can use this API. Uh, for this automation, we have used this Google Sheets. Uh, our automation takes URLs from this column, and when the automation runs successfully, it gives us the screenshot URLs in the column B. So I already have built this automation. We'll test this automation and then I'll tell you how you can build one for yourself. So let's test this automation. So the automation is capturing the screenshot. And once it captures, it will update our Google Sheets. Okay, so our automation have run successfully. Here are the screenshots and we can see uh, the first screenshot. So we are getting the full page screenshot because I have used a parameter uh, which gives us the full page screenshot. So I will tell you how this automation works. The first mode we are using is with the Google Sheets from where we would be taking our URLs from. Uh, I have authenticated my Google Sheet. Uh, this is where it the node asks you uh, from which sheet you want to take uh, the first data from. So this is where we are taking the data from. This is the particular sheet in our spreadsheet, which is sheet one. Okay. So the next node we are using is the HTTP and the method we are using is get. What you can do is you can go to the documentation to learn more about the API and see what other parameters uh, this API can use. Uh, so the basic parameters are the URL. So this is the URL for which you want to take the screenshot for. This is the access key which you get when you sign up for the Capture Kits account. Uh, you get 100 free credits to test this API. Uh, there are more parameters that you can see. So I have used this parameter, full page parameter and full page scroll parameter. You can read more about these parameters. Okay. So back on our Anytime automation uh, to our HTTP request, the method is used uh, is get this is the endpoint of that particular API here you can see the endpoint uh, the parameters we are using is access key this is my access key you can have yours uh, you can get your access key in the dashboard here you can get your access key copy it from here uh, the URL uh, is the second parameter which ne is needed to run this uh, API successfully which we are taking from our Google Sheets so I have mapped it here next is the full pages uh, parameter for which I have kept the value to true because I want to take the full page screenshot the, the other parameter is full page scroll uh, which is again true and to get the URLs uh, of the screenshot uh, you have to also use this parameter which is return underscore s3 underscore url and keep keep the value it uh, keep its value to true now once we get the urls of screenshot uh, we need to get them in our google sheet and therefore the third module we are using is uh, google sheets and update we are updating the google sheet uh, particularly the row as you can see the operation we have used is updating row Again, it would ask us for which sheet we want to update, uh, which particular sheet we want to update, which spreadsheet we want to update is URL screenshot uh, and the particular sheet is sheet one. Uh, as you can see, it is sheet one. And this is uh, to match where we want to uh, take URLs from. Pardon, this is to match uh, uh, the column, the row. Uh, so for apple.com we want to take it here so we have kept it to apple.com uh, we have mapped it from the google sheets yes we have mapped it from here so we want that for apple.com uh, for the first url we want the screenshot to be here and the screenshot urls which we will get from our http request so this was the simple automation uh, built in any 10 we have more tutorials on make.com and zapier if you are if you want to use this automation as is in your any 10 account you can use the blueprint if you are watching this video on youtube you would find the blueprint in the description section and if you're watching this video in the blog you would find 
it uh, below the video in the blog. Also, Screenshot API offers you thousand free credits to use. So when you sign up for the first time, you can use it for free uh, and not thousand. Pardon, you can use hundred free credits. It offers hundred free credits to test. So you can almost build this automation for free and test. And if you like the API, you can upgrade your plan. We have different plans and different credits are uh, given in those different plans. Thank you for watching this video. Have a good day.